Good Question on WCCO 4 News at 10. It is a safety hazard most parents never even think about, but it's probably in your house right now. Surmised that he stuck his head out and popped the screen out and no, fell head first. I just heard that a kid jumped or accidentally fell out the seventh floor. It's he probably leaned on the window and it went straight down like that. Nearly 5,000 children nationwide fall through screened windows every year, but as Darcy Pollan shows us, a new state law could change that soon. All right, she's still alive. Last year, Ruth Shagabee's one year old daughter, Layla, fell from this fourth story apartment window. What are these latches doing? Nothing. They don't even work. Just push this right out. Miraculously, Layla survived. Not all children are so fortunate. The reason we have building codes is to make things safe for people, and obviously, these kind of screens are not safe. So, State Senator Linda Berglund is introducing new legislation requiring safer screens. It would be for new construction, and it would be for multi unit buildings, and it would be a screen that would hold at least a 70 pound weight of a child. Screens like this. This is uh, steel and high tensile stainless steel. No child would go through this. It's even almost impossible for an adult to break through it. This week, developer Jim Graham is installing the heavy-duty screens, replacing all those in the apartment complexes where Layla fell and another boy died from a fall. I feel a lot better. As you said, a lot more, a lot of weight is off of your shoulders. You know what I mean? Knowing that you're that high up and that there's going to be something safer for the windows. I helped design it, but I didn't. I don't get paid for it. I just did it so that we save children. If the legislation passes, it'll be called Layla's Law after Ruth's baby who beat the odds and lived. I mean, it came a little too late for a lot of people, but I'm glad that it is happening. These heavy-duty screens cost about $100 each. That's double regular screen costs. But experts tell Darcy they rarely need to be replaced.